gorgeous American classics built by some of the best designers and builders in the world. Uh, this is Gearhead Heaven, Steam After Hours. I'm in love. Check these cars out. 49 Cadillac convertible, stunning. 72 Vet, designed by Bobby Alloway, gorgeous. Stunning 62 Bel Air, 69 Mustang, a little Mopar here. This, my friends, is heaven for gearheads. Seam after hours, pretty special. Whoa, look at this grill and look at this engine compartment. Wow. Wow. My kind of bling. Sick! 71 Mustang Mach 1 right here. I got a 70 Mach 1 from DJ Funkmaster Flex. I haven't yet picked it up. I'm going to New York to get it. Actually, Thanksgiving weekend. And all my cars so far are original. Numbers match original. The Mustang is not, and I'm going to have fun with it. This is giving me some amazing ideas. This thing is beautiful. Super cool Buick Skylark. This engine. That's what I'm talking about. Check this out, guys. This is the world debut of the 2016 Rolls Royce Great. Black bikes in addition, they call it by Ball. 22 inch wall wheels, of course, the Regiment. This car is so much sexier in person than what you're seeing in the video. You're going to see in pictures. In pictures, I honestly found it okay. In person, it's pretty amazing. Black Bison Rolls Royce Wraith by Walder Nash. And also in the Toyo Tires booth, this is the world debut of the Ford Italia with a custom wide body kit by Misha Designs. Pretty cool. I'm here with one of my favorite guys in the industry. This is Dave Smith from Factory 5 Racing, and we're checking out these insane cars. Dave, what's going on this year, and what are your hot, what are your best sellers? Well, everybody loves our replica, our Cobra Rook. It's been 20 years, and we celebrate our 20th anniversary this year. So we made a special car, special wheels, special engine for guys at Cone Debris Shocks, Wilwood Brakes, all of our kind of partner companies put together and built this car. Um, and then Hot Rod here, one of our customers built this car, we went a bunch of car shows, we said, hey, if you win car shows, come to see them and we'll show off. So nothing makes a Hot Rod disappear like having Courtney Hansen stay in front of it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We'll take a look at the engine and the interior here. Unbelievable. And what's great about these cars, they look exactly like the actual car, but for a fraction of the price. So you, you know can the actually cool drive. I mean, here's something that one of the reasons why we've been successful is the cars look like a vintage car, but they're modern underneath, so they're easy to drive. You know, next weekend down in Florida, we're going to do a cool cruise. Yes. Yeah, we'll do that again. So check this out. You get yeah, to drive no. a Cobra, a Cobra replica that looks exactly like it. Well, you know what's fun on your show? We did an original Cobra versus our car. And, and honestly, I got to drive the original car. And the original car, if you ever want to have respect for guys that race, that car was a handful. And I got our car, modern steering, modern race. We ran a lot faster. But the old car was on the legend. The guys that raced them, they really earned their pay. So. Check out this legend, my favorite car of all time. The 1964 Shelby Cobra Daytona Coupe. Designed by Peter Brock and built by Shelby American Incorporated. It raced in Daytona Sebring, Le Mans, and broke 23 land speed records at Bonneville. Unbelievable. This car has been driven by so many of the greatest drivers in history, and it is amazing. Everyone's gathering around to watch her put Swarovski crystals on the Porsche one by one. How long did this take you? 500 hours. Gorgeous 1959 Chevy Biscayne won Best in SEMA show. It's built by Troy Chapanier and Rad Rides. All of their work is absolutely incredible. Look at this paint job, those gorgeous tail fins. <gasps> stunning, stunning car.
grade 8 contender and um, I actually photographed it in Detroit a couple years ago. And let's see what's going on in here. Wow. All the petals, chrome petals, all the gauges are so beautiful. Look at this beautiful 312. Cool wheels. Oh, how neat is that? Check out this sick Thunderbird. From the A pillar forward, it's a 67, and from the A pillar back, it's a 70. All right, we're here at the BASF booth at SEMA After Hours. One of the most talked about vehicles in the entire show is Mike and Jim Ring of the Ring Brothers, 1965 to 66, a wide body fastback that is all carbon fiber. Earlier, I saw Jim, I asked him about the car, and he said, Courtney, go ahead and unveil it after hours. I said, Jim, are you serious? He goes, I'm serious. Just unveil it and yourself, look at it, and take photos of it and cover it back up. Jim said we could do it. Jim told us to do it. Jim, I was oh. there. I witnessed it. 